Okay, welcome back. Um, I recently was trying to start up a um, Angular 4 type app within VS Code. Normally, we're using the fit full flat version of Visual Studio, so that's going to be Visual Studio uh, 2013, 2015, or 2017, all of which work perfectly fine. But when you're coming to do a, a build or start an application, which I mean, that might be once what? every three months every six months depending on the environment you're working in uh, there's some prerequisites that you want to make sure that you have uh, covered on the machine and uh, I hadn't been using uh, VS code so I, I hadn't had to configure the base station um, for uh, certain modules and while I know the code is supposed to work um, it wasn't working within the environment and, and this is this is the error that I was getting. So, npm run server ts not found and npm run uh, tsc. So that's a TypeScript compiler not found. Okay, so I'm sitting down here thinking, well, this is working in Visual Studio. What I needed to do was make sure that I ran some prerequisites um, on a machine uh, in order to get things running. So I checked inside the the package and uh, this was the 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 command that was trying to execute so the TypeScript compiler and the server uh, and this worked fine within uh, Visual Studio uh, but VS Code was just not not making it uh, not making the grade at the time I checked here uh, I went from ES5 to ES6 uh, still had no luck um, and then you know you check on the forums you check on github and uh, it will say you know hey make sure that your root is starting from dot and not dot dot things like that um, so that was the base configuration what I found was the fix for me uh, was make sure that these were all uh, installed or reinstalled lurk um, globally so concurrently light server and TypeScript after launching those three um, I was able to actually get the server up and running and, and here you go so let's just give this a go so there's the command no errors and then the server launches uh, as one might expect so if you do have this problem just try to make sure that you're running uh, these specific scripts I know that some it really all depends on on your station and uh, how you're actually set up but for me this was a fix to make sure that I had these uh, specific modules loaded um, via the, the npm command all right so good luck with uh, what you're doing with your project and uh, I'll see you guys back next time Thanks for watching.